hello guys <coughs> the agenda today would be discussing the XML parcel transformation so as you can see over here I have a source definition file and I have my source file over here now this is an, uh, as you can see this is uh, an XML markup right I can see a set of values for an employee like ID name and salary right so I need to extract these values I need to parse this XML markup so I need XML parcel transformation for that and that is precisely our agenda today so I'll start with importing this definition this flat file definition into my Informatica designer so I'll just say all files and I'll search for this XML source over here and it says I click on next and next and I just name it as XML markup over here so I say finish and since this definition is already existing I say replace okay so I save this thing then I go to my mapping I say create XML parser transformation this is my mapping that I'll be creating over here and and effectively I have my flat file definition that contains the XML markup and I need to parse that and I need to build my XML parser transformation so based on a schema definition file that will describe the elements what all elements I will be having you know then I need to uh, use to capture the values right so I'll use this i60 file uh, before that I just wanted to show the structure that I have it is very similar uh, to the markup okay so that structure says employee being the root element ID name and salary being the child element so this schema definition confirms to the XML markup that is present in our flat file right so we will build our XML parser transformation on this schema so I say open and I click on next I say finish right so I'll just connect my XML markup to the data input port for the XML parser transformation as you can see over here I have a data input port that will collect all the markup and I have output ports that just got created out of the schema definition file that I used to create this XML parser so I can see ID name and salary being three different uh, ports created so I'll just go to my target I already have that in place so it's just a flat file again and I am collecting the values of ID name and salary in a flat file so I will just connect them and I say control s and I'll generate my workflow to run this mapping and let's see uh, let's refresh the folder that I already opened in my in my workflow manager and I say and I'll look for that workflow and this is the one that I have I'll just simply connections are okay right I've already pointed it to the correct connections so we will just run this thing and we will look for as you see it got succeeded so we'll look for our target file that just got created over here so as you can see all the values right from the markup they got collected into a flat file for target so hope you have enjoyed the video thank you